everyone, it's me, your gamer ghoul friend. I'm back here with I Dream of Indie Games to play an incredible indie for you featured on this year's Steam Next Fest. This game comes to us from Dogu Bomb and Raw Fury and is called Blue Prince. Blue Prince is a puzzle adventure game where one must navigate a variety of shifting corridors and changing rooms in order to solve the mystery of Mount Holly Manor. Now with all of that out of the way, let's get ready to solve the mystery. Wow. Okay. Very spooky. Let's get into it. I'm really curious about the mystery that we'll be solving here. So we have to find the 46th room in this estate in order to receive the gift from this will. How cool. Right off the bat, the idea of a house with ever-changing rooms and I have to I have to find the correct room it's feeling very House of Leaves which that book may already be top of mind for me for a couple of other reasons um, but if you haven't read Mark C. Danieleski's House of Leaves very like the idea of a house with like a secret room and the rooms are ever changing feels very that it's very also um uh hill house uh mm, and i can't think of her name shirley jackson hill house uh also has a room within a house that no one can locate the red room um interesting and or at least that room materializes as a bunch of different rooms simon welcome to mount holly you may not remember but i have fond memories of your many visits here as a young boy and i hope these rooms provide you with as much amusement as it did in those lost summer days by the time you read this i will assume you are fully aware of my last wishes and all the details of the bequest Please do not mistake my intentions in giving you this challenge as a lack of confidence. I assure you, nothing could have been further from my mind when I chose you as my heir. With that said, there are a few ground rules of this commission covered in fine print of my will that I feel I should bring to your attention. One, no tools or items may be brought onto the estate from the outside. Two, Tools and items found on the estate may not be taken off the estate. Three, you may not stay overnight. The Mount Holly blueprint. This will serve as a useful map and inventory log during your adventure. Okay. The antechamber, the entrance hall. Okay. And then we can call it a day over here. And then we've got this grid system over here on this side. Uh, there's the entrance hall. This is the antechamber. Okay, interesting. Very cool. Let's see if we can let's see if we can make some real progress in four days. Searching the estate can be exhausting. Each time you enter a room, you will lose one. Okay, that's what the feet are for. When you no longer have any footprints left, you will be too tired to continue searching the manor and must call it a day. You know what? Let's go in the card room. Let's see if it's like a Oh, huh? I get to pick a room. Okay. Oh, this is neat. Okay. So bedroom, whenever I enter the bedroom, I get two footsteps. The closet gives me two items and then there's a hallway. So let's, let's go closet first and let's see what kind of items we have at our disposal. Oh, pair of dice, inventory dice, or excuse me, a pair of ivory dice plus two dice while drafting you may use dice to roll new floor plans oh that's good and then a key okay so i've got a key to a locked room okay see now my my feet are at 49 my feet my steps my stamina we'll call it stamina okay this one's giving me a den a parlor and a hallway let's go den because i want to see what the diamond does Okay, I've got one diamond. Will it tell me what those do? Gems can be used while drafting to pay for special floor plans. Okay. Keys can be used to unlock locked doors you find in the house. And then dice to re-roll new plans. 
coins can be used in shop rooms on the estate to purchase goods and services. Interesting. Okay. Oh, this is really cool. I really like the art style too. It reminds me of um, Killer Frequency, if you play that game. Uh, this very stylized look um, has become really popular in indie games lately, and I'm really glad it has because I think it's it's just so stunning. Okay, let's go left. Ooh, a boudoir. Oh, a storeroom. I get one key, one coin for going here. Yeah, let's do that. I'm trying to get, I think my tactic is gonna be get as many items as I possibly can. And then hopefully that helps like Whenever you enter the chapel, you lose money. Okay. Bedroom gives me two foot. Let's go bedroom. Let's see. Let me check my map. Oh, no. Oh, I probably shouldn't have made a bedroom here. Because now I just have one. Yeah, this is all boarded up now because I made the wrong decision. Oh, okay, all right, okay. So you've really got to pay attention. I've backed myself into a corner here, so now I have to build out this way. Oh, oh no. no. Okay, all right. I definitely, you definitely have to be really smart about what you're doing. Clearly, I am not really smart about what I'm doing. I goofed. That was a that was a tough goof. That was a silly goof for me to have made. I can't believe I goofed that hard. Oh no. The security level determines the amount of keycard security doors that will be deployed in your estate. Should you expect to see a one or two security wait. Example, you should expect to see one or two security doors with a low setting and five or six with a high. Low. Why would I want Offline mode. This mode determines the default setting. The security door will be to set if the power is lost during a blackout. As a general safety rule, offline mode should be set to unlocked if any staff are working on the state. Oh! Fish! Ah, dinner is served. Today's main course is a lemon glazed salmon, charbroiled Cajun spiced. Uh? Made I knew I was coming. <laughs> Charboil Cajun spice salmon lemon butter sauce served over spinach leaf. 20 stamina plus an additional 10 stamina if you have an aquarium. Yeah. Uh, I'll have dinner. Sure. I mean, if I don't eat it now, I'm gonna run out of the stamina points later, right? But I don't know what they're trying to get me to figure out. So, 14. Uh oh. Plus three is 17? Oh no! Nope. Oh no! Wait. Five, ooh. Five times, maybe this is times two? Ten? Aha! Okay. Um. 12 minus 7 is 5 times 4 is 20. I'm a, I'm a puzzle genius. Don't ever doubt me again. Don't you ever doubt me again. I knew I would solve it. I knew I would solve it. I knew it. I said it was a genius. I said it was smart. No, 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 don't go back two seconds ago to when I said, am I stupid? I knew I was smart, okay, brother? I knew I was gonna get it, and guess what? We got a key. Nope. Luck is not on my side. I can't coat check my items, though. <laughs> Let's, uh, check an item. All right. Darn. That bites. Well... That's the end of our run. Let's go ahead and we'll call it a day. We have nowhere else we can go. Call it.
I didn't get my grandfather's fortune, which I didn't think I would be able to, obviously, because, like, it's a, you know, it's a demo. That's okay. I'm upset, but... <laughs> I'm more upset that there isn't more to this game right now. Obviously, look, we're all gonna do it together. We're gonna wishlist this on Steam. We're not gonna do it all together. Obviously, incredible game. I had so much fun playing this. I want to thank the developers again for sharing this game with us. I had an absolute blast. This game was promoted for Steam Next Fest, so you should be able to still play the demo. So go ahead, download the demo, play it for yourself. Let me know if you got even further than I did. Don't forget to go wishlist it on Steam so that you can get the game whenever it full releases and play it for yourself. Let me know if you got even further than I did in my playthrough. I'm probably going to play this again. I will not lie to you. I'm probably going to pick it up again and see if I can get even further because, man, that last day really kicked me. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I definitely did. Thank you again to the developers for sharing this game with us. And I hope all of you have a wonderful rest of your day and keeping a voice to the voiceless in indie gaming. Bye.